okay guys so this lecture is basically to give you an uh you know a guide to solve your comprehension that are in your oxford progressive books so we're on to unit 9 which is sports now this is one this one is gonna be very favorite for the boys so this is the first lecture of the month of april let's begin the topics the comprehension basically we'll be studying from this unit is the language of advertisements which is on page number 206 to 208 can clearly see the pictures so basically advertisement what are advertisements basically advertisements are a means to market what a company is selling or what services a company are, is providing so here since the unit is about sports there are different advertisements that have used different sportsmen to advertise their wearing material to advertise their their channels to advertise their gear to advertise the, some of the, to advertise their styling as well for example they have used michael jordan to market their clothing and they used david beckham to market their styling and they have used wasim akram they have used wasim Ak akram for you know gift offers so these are strong means uh, for advertisements because these men are very, very popular figures in their field. Moving on. So we basically have to go through the reading for understanding from this comprehension. So let, let's read. As soon as you read these words, you know that they are advertisements. The writers want to catch your attention immediately. They want you to be excited by what they're offering for sale to be convinced that their products are the greatest. Of course, they want you to buy. The language they use is exaggerated. Superlatives, imperatives, and explanation marks are used to persuade you. That these are things that are used to gain a reader's attention. So what we have to do is we have to match them to their definition for example the first word is unique unique basically describes a thing that is very different is very you know rare so the only one will be the phrase that is matched highly can be used can be uh, put with extremely and so on you can you can clearly see how I matched the first two for you guys you have to basically match the words to their definition or to their phases on the right hand side. This is a very easy approach. You can use a dictionary for your help or you can even view the advertisements again to get a know-how. So this would be it. Okay. From the matching portion and moving on. Read the advertisements again, list the words and phrases under the following headings. The list has been started for you. For example, you have to list down the words that use exaggeration. Exaggeration basically means to describe something very, very highly. And imperatives basically, you know, show an action towards something. So you have to use these examples to continue and write down the phrases in their respective columns i hope you find this lecture this lecture uh, this lecture helpful for your attempt in the comprehension that would be it thank you very much see you guys very soon